today I'm here with my third part with palette of the month for March and it is the mini Masquerade from Youth Place if, if you didn't know and I am doing a palette bingo today and I am doing a normal palette bingo and not a palette bingo with order rules so yeah <laughs> we will see how this goes so I will just generate and I will take five shades so I have five one through 16 and I hope you can see here so four 11 four again seven four seven eleven six and three three four seven six and eleven i think <laughs> so i'm going to swatch them okay so these are the shades i got so it is dahlia sula sobo calabar and cairo and cairo is actually like my favorite shade in this palette so yeah, I will try to figure out what I want to do with these. I don't think it's going to be that hard. I got at least one matte, this one, but I know that Cairo, it has some shimmer specs in it, but it's easily done. I can easily do it in my crease if I want to. So, want to, what's up? <laughs> Jesus, it's Monday, okay, I'm tired. I'm always tired, I know, but okay, I will try to figure out what I want to do with these and then I come back. Okay, so I don't know if I'm going to show you the colors because I'm not going to hold this palette because it hasn't got any, any mirror and I hate it by, by US place, but yeah, okay. I'm going to start with Cairo. Maybe I can put a little picture here. I'm going to start with Cairo and take it in my crease. And I think it worked pretty good in the crease actually. I had it in the second part with this video. With this video, with this palette, I think at least. So I'm just popping this in my crease. And then I want to go in with Calabar and take it out here. And I am not super sure how this will look on my eye. That is just like how little I have really played with this palette. So I think it's so fun to play with this more. This was really nice. It isn't that much of a shimmer shade. And I think that it's pretty like, it's many, it's many colors. It's many shades in this palette that are like that. They look like super shimmer in the pan, but then when you put it on the eyes, they are not like that shimmery. I have nothing against it though. I don't know though if this would have worked like in my crease, but out here on my lid it works and I can blend it into my crease and that is something I really like. Okay, and then I want to take Dahlia, I think. Yes, and put it in here. Just because I really wanted to use this in another, in the first part with this palette, but I didn't, so yeah. Okay, this feels a little bit like the same. It is a shimmer, but it's not like metallic. 
maybe UV's place has metallics. I actually don't know. Okay, I don't know if this was like as popping as I wanted it to be. I'm just going over with this darker shade here. Just to have a better blend. Okay, I don't think, I thought it was going to be more like popping blue. But I actually think that I like this. Sometimes I feel it's good that it's not turned out as I thought from the beginning. Okay, I actually think that I really like this. Okay, so I actually think that I am pretty happy with this for my lids so i will take away the fallouts fix my base and then i come back and i have two more shades to go i have this one and this one so yeah i will fix this and then i come back and we finish up this palette bingo okay so i will start with sobo and take it like to here maybe and then i will go in with sola and pop it in my inner corner and maybe not my inner corner but on my lower lash so i will start with this so and then i go in with sola and i will actually spray it so it like gets super intense so just in here And I also take it like up on the blue because I want to connect the lower lash with my eyelid. So something like this. So I, okay, so I will just pop on some mascara and something in my waterline and also a lippy and then I come back. Okay, so this is the finished look for my waterline. I used Zulu from Colourpop and on my lips I used Riot from Lime Crime and I like this look. I think it's <laughs> nothing wrong with it. I like it and I don't know if I would have taken the pinkish shade here if I could have chose my shades but I think like the green and the blue it went good and maybe I would have taken an inner corner highlight maybe like this one just to have something bright in my inner corner but other than that I like the look and it was fun to do a palette bingo without order rules so I can do whatever I liked it was though a little bit harder because I had to think a little bit what I wanted to do but yeah this is my third video with the Mini Masquerade from US Place. I will try to do a fourth video. I don't know what I'm going to do for that video. Maybe I just want to go... Yeah. I don't know. So we will see. So I really hope you like this video. And if you're not subscribed to my channel, please do. So you don't miss any of my videos. And I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!